All right, I've had a pretty good amount of people ask me for a uh, tutorial for headlock, so I'm gonna try to bust this out as quick as possible because I did it once before and I tried to upload it and YouTube fucked me for whatever reason it didn't upload it. So here we go. Um, in the video, in the cover I did, I was playing in drop D. I'm tuned to standard right now, which you could still play the song perfectly fine. You just gotta move anything that I was playing in the low E down two frets so it still works um so pretty much for the verse parts i'm playing um i'm holding on the fourth fret on the g string muting the d string with my ring finger and then i'm just moving like the bass note around on the a string so it's So we got zero, four, five, and you're holding them for like different amounts of time. So the first time it's then back down to four and the second time it's zero, four, five again, back down to four. You just hold it on the five for a shorter amount of time and then Just a third time, so you go zero four five zero two. So and then you'll play this full chord, which is uh, I'm doing four four five and the D G B string, and then the first one. Since I'm in standard, I'm playing it on the fourth fret in the cover I did since I'm in drop D. Since I'm in standard, you'll do the second fret and it's a... Hold on. Okay, so it's two on the low E, uh, open A string. Sorry, open A, then two on the A, and then five on the A string. So the verse again, I'll play through. Like I said, this whole time I'm like muting the D string, except for those last couple. And that's the verse part. And then the chorus part is, it's really simple. It's, um, you're sort of, you're barring the second fret here and you're only playing the uh, A, G and B strings and you're going. So that's, uh, you're going two, two on the A string, two on the G string. Sorry, I got an email. <laughs> Three on the B string. And then you're going up to four and going back to two, 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 two on the uh, G and B string. up on the fifth fret, back to two, three again. I don't know how best to explain that, but you can, you sort of get the gist on the two, when you're, when you're playing the bass note on the second fret and fifth fret on your A string, you'll hold in this three on the B string. And on the fourth fret, it's still just two. And then um, back to the verse again, same deal. And then here, I've got this song 
up here. Let me see what I'm forgetting. Guess you'll go through that twice and then the chorus again. The... And then yeah, this little bridge here. Which you're you're just playing those same strings, but you're just playing the notes. You're not playing it as a chord. So it's so still honing in that uh fourth fret on the G string. And then on the A string going open to zero, four, two, five. And then on the last part, on the last one she does, she goes. So. That's two on the low E. And then zero two on the A, and I sort of just go back and forth, I'm sort of filling space there. I kind of guessed at that part, so. And then back up to the fifth fret, and then you do the whole verse part again. And then you got chorus again. Uh, Pretty sure. Let's see. All right. So in that last chorus, she does. And the very last time through she goes which is two on the low e four on the d two on the g and an open e she's going e d high e g does that twice and then does this chord where it's fifth fret on the A, fourth fret on the D, and then barring two on the uh, G and B string, and going that's um, A D then B and G, and then just goes A D G. So I'll play that. And the whole last bit, she plays these full chords with that uh, holding a four four five on the D G B string. It's Again, you're holding out that chord and just changing the bass note around, and it starts off zero two five on the A string. Then the two on the low E. Then two five on the A again. And then you're doing one more of the zero four two five and then she ends on the open a so a lot of it is um muting like the right strings at the right time throughout the verse part throughout this part like when i'm switching around i'm kind of moving my fingers you're kind of that's kind of hard to figure out but once you get it down you'll see it's all muscle memory from there so that last bit one more time and 
that's pretty much it. That is as concise as I could uh, make it. If you guys have any questions, just ask them in the comments. I'll try to answer. Thanks.